Hi, I'm Calvin Milbury, the Executive Director of the Fredericton Community Foundation. We help caring donors support community causes that enhance lives. We're an endowment-based charitable foundation, so gifts are pooled and invested, and the earnings are annually granted back to the community. For over 65 years, the foundation has made meaningful and lasting impacts in the greater Fredericton region. Our foundation has a charitable purpose of building a better community for all. To support that, we strive to inspire and encourage community philanthropy. And to that end, since 2010, the foundation has annually awarded a Philanthropy in Action Award to a deserving community member who has generously given of their time, talents, and resources to better their community. Keeping in that tradition, this year, the foundation has selected John T. Clark with, to be honored with the Philanthropy in Action Award for 2022. John T. Clark is a family-oriented community leader. Over many years, he has helped to establish and build several community organizations, notably the Fredericton YMCA, the Chalmers Foundation, and the Pine Grove Nursing Home. In more recent years, through his establishment of the J.T. Clark Family Foundation, John and his family have made a significant difference in our community by supporting over 60 organizations. When speaking with John's friends and family and colleagues, three words that were often used as to describe him were dedicated, determined, and generous. For us, John Clark is the embodiment of philanthropy in action. On behalf of the Fredericton Community Foundation, it is my honor to present John T. Clark with the 2022 Philanthropy in Action Award. To complement the award, the foundation is awarding a $10,000 grant to a charity of your choice. Congratulations. Hello, friends of the Fredericton Community Foundation. I've always felt that philanthropy in action had two components, time and money. If you don't take the time, you can't get the money. In my case, I was so fortunate that I could take the time because my soulmate of 65 years, Wilma, made it possible for me to get the job done while she was raising such a fine family. And she also helped count the money on more than one occasion. And so, for enabling me to take the time, I would like to accept this award on her behalf. As you know, a $10,000 grant goes with this award. And I am pleased to tell you that the recipient this year will be the Fredericton Homeless Shelters Incorporated to establish an endowed fund. In addition, I'm happy to announce that our foundation will match that amount with another $10,000. But it gets better. The directors of Fredericton Homeless Shelters will add another $10,000 for a total of $30,000 in this new endowed fund, which will be called the David J. Wilson Endowed Fund. David, having been a charter director of our foundation and a past recipient of this PIA award. Thank you all for being part of this event. Hi, I'm Warren Maddox from Fredericton Homeless Shelters. Congratulations, Mr. Clark. This is a wonderful award for you, for the work that you've done over the years in supporting all kinds of, of organizations throughout the city, including ours at the shelters. This award that you've done and the creation of the David Wilson Endowment enables us to, to invest the money to provide operating funds for the shelters. We are proud to be able to, to put in money to this endowment to create something that's really going to last. It's an incredible legacy. And thank you so very much. Mr. Clark, congratulations on being recognized with the 2022 Philanthropy in Action Award. I know that over the years, you've contributed to the founding and to the development of many community-based nonprofit organizations. 
Your support has elevated numerous social causes and undoubtedly inspired many others to help deliver critical programs that promote the well-being of those in need. Countless New Brunswickers, especially those in the Capital Region, have benefited from the support of the dozens of organizations that you have sponsored. Through your vision and your generosity, New Brunswickers can dream bigger and reach higher. Thank you for your sustained contributions and once again, congratulations. Hi everyone, I'm Sheila Nocto and I'm a partner in our Fredericton office at Stuart McKelvey. We have proudly been the title sponsor since 2010 and are thrilled to again support the Philanthropy in Action celebration this year. On behalf of Stuart McKelvey, I would like to extend our sincere congratulations to John Clark on receiving the well-deserved award. Huge thanks to John for his many contributions in our community. Hi, I'm Rene Blanchard of the Blanchard LeBlanc Wealth Management Group at Dominion Securities. We are the corporate sponsor for the raffle and silent auction. And as such, we are going to draw some uh, winning numbers today. The original winner of the TV provided by 3D Datacom has graciously donated it back. So we are going to draw again. And I'm mixing, not looking. I've got one ticket and the winner is Nancy Ferguson. The second draw is going to be for the Harvest Music Package, which is donated by Harvest, Delta Fredericton, the Snooty Fox, and Rustico Kings West Brewery. And the wi winner is Dr. Mary Peterson. The third draw. The third draw is going to for the 10 weeks of free groceries from Atlantic Superstore, also known as the $1,000 Atlantic Superstore gift card. And the winner is, again, Dr. Mary Peterson. <laughs> okay, the last draw. The last draw is for your new summer wardrobe, which is a $1,000 gift card to Robert Simmons Clothing. And the winner is Allison Pizzy, hopefully I've said that correctly, Allison Pizzy. And that's it, four draws. Thank you very much. Thank you to all our sponsors who made this Philanthropy in Action celebration possible. Our title sponsor, Stuart McAlvey. Our raffle and silent auction sponsor, RBC Dominion Security, Blanchard LeBlanc Wealth Management Group. Our video production partner, East Lens Media. Our video sponsor, Bulletproof. And thank you to our Philanthropy in Action sponsors, Grant Thornton, CIBC, Mays Reynolds Financial Group, Ignite Fredericton, Wilson Insurance, Confederation M&A, Chalmers Foundation. <laughs>